Okay. Hey, hello, y'all. Uh, just give me just a minute here for this to catch up. Catch up. Uh, and stuff. So, I uh, can pause my YouTube. So, anyway, just the spur of the moment thing here. So, anyway. Damn it. Thanks. What? Thank you. Okay. Any day now. And well, you see the title there: Propaganda Programming and More, MK Ultra, Divide and Conquer. And anyway, um, that you know, <laughs> self-explanatory there. Um, come on, come on. <clears throat> Alrighty then. Um, I, I was, uh, you know, looking at the. I'm not, you know, just uh, how it says, you know, the Tower of Babel revisited. And that's what I've been seeing of the whole on here, on the whole of the YouTube, this community, whatever, huge community. I never called myself part of that, to be clear. Uh, but those, that you know what I'm saying. The whole community on here, the whole of the YouTube, it's like the Tower of Babel, uh, you know. And that's, I, you know me, I hate to bring up these books, you know, like the Bible. But you know, you see what happened in in there, you know, when the with the Tower of Babel and all. Uh, let's see here, you know, um, it's, it says, according to the story, a united humanity in the generations following the Great Flood, speaking a single language and migrating eastward, comes to the land of Shinar. There they agree to build a city and a tower tall enough to reach heaven. God, observing their city and tower, confounds their speech so that they can no longer understand each other and scatters them around the world. Some modern scholars have associated the Tower of Babel with known structures. They don't really alleged they don't really know where it is. It's what it's saying. It could be a number of these structures. They're saying it could have meant the Tower of Babel associated with the Eti Etimenaki. Eti something like that. It's a ziggurat dedicated to the Mesopotamian god Marduk or the great ziggurat. It says it was 91 meters high. And I don't think that's it. Uh, anyway, I don't know. I'm, like, I'm no expert. I'm just reading from Wikipedia and you know how reliable a lot of that shit is anyway. But just the general story there in, in, in that, you know, um, in, it, in its, you know, like with the cycles and, and how history repeats itself. That's the way I look at the Bible, like a history book. But you know how they change shit and got to dig deeper into what it's really meaning and a lot of contradictions and stuff in it as well. But anyway, um, and, and look at look at us here today on here you know it's the tower of babel people <laughs> um just not understanding each other i think on the on the whole here that and and you know trying to do one up on everybody else and you know make themselves look better and blah 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 you know and that's But the words there, 
their speech is confounded so they can't understand each other and that's what I see going on on here and not a hundred percent but you get what I'm saying it's like I'm trying to say here um And, it, and it's saying in, in the top there, everybody spoke a single language, you know, and look what's coming around on us here, what they're trying to do with that aspect and the, the religion and everything, um, the one world, everything there because of how because <laughs> they People wonder why they create all these laws and stuff. It's because people can't get along with each other. Most people, uh, us on here, a lot of us can, you know, uh, but, and uh, that's what they're using to justify what they do into us all as a whole of humanity, not singling no, no people out. I'm not looking at the chat here for anybody even out there, um, but uh, hello to whoever is out there. Uh, but you know, in my childhood and, and stuff, you know, I did read these books and stuff like that, and and I always looked deeper than what it was saying you know I wanted to know more and that's sometimes you can know too much just and when you connect these dots together and then you see this stuff happening right in front of your face and all you can do about it is get on here and tell people about your what you know what you experienced in your childhood growing up what you understand of it all pieces of the puzzle we are and once we all figure out what piece we are i think things will start to make more sense to us as individuals and the whole um but uh Anyway, like I said, you know, got so many people on here, just like, like we say, out for number one, out for what's benefiting them, you know, donate, you know, the e-begging, and it's just ridiculous on here anymore. Um, not just that, but, you know, these peoples that, like I said, I ain't singling out no one. This is just my observations of everything that I see going on. I don't watch that much stuff on here, but what I hear from others and, and stuff, and it's just, like I've said here, it's just <laughs> the Tower of Babel. Uh, everybody babbling a bunch of bullshit, and they don't want to hear like things like like this you know <clears throat> because I don't know you know they just the programming I, I, I would say that's why it's there the MK Ultra uh, how they programmed us culturally uh, you know socially all that uh, to so we would don't understand each other. Um, <clears throat> that's that's one of the the big problems on here. Mm. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it is. Um, because we all want the same thing here, right? We all want to be free. And live our life the way we want to, not what they say to live. 
I'm living my life now how I want to see me. You know, um, and the more time you spend away from the YouTube, you know, the all these shows, like I say, these, it's, like I say, I don't do much. I listen in, to people, what people tell me and stuff, and that's what they observe as well, you know, is that, that you know, uh, Hey there, uh, <clears throat> Foxy. Um, and crap, I lost my thought there. I'm sorry. Um, but I, I will put this link for the tire battle, even though you can Google it yourself, or whatever. Um, but, uh, Oh, um, and <clears throat> yeah, you know, in the propaganda, you know, that we get put put subjected to. Uh, daily, um, there are some you can't avoid, like the TV and things, but when you go out, you see it. Um, excuse me. Um, <clears throat> uh, everywhere. Uh, and, uh, it's, it's sometimes hard to, to, not hard, but, um, yeah, I will say sometimes it's it's hard to even go out sometimes because you know you're gonna have to see that and deal with that stuff, but you gotta do it anyway. And and it's hard. Some things they just bombard you with, and you just get mm, so like angered about it and stuff. And you come and do a rant on the YouTube or whatever, you know, take it out on anyway. Uh, I've done that myself, you know, the news stories <clears throat> and stuff, and but I don't do that much no more because that's what they want. How you want? They want people to react uh, in that way. Um, anyway, what time have I got here? Um, Eleven minutes. My God. Uh, Thank you, thank you. Um, I was gonna <clears throat> paint there too, but anyway, I think I got and what I wanted to needed to say there and put out there into the void consciousness, whatever the hell you want to call this fucking YouTube shit. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Just there it is. Okay. Anyway, um. <laughs> Yeah, like I said, I've done said it, so I ain't gonna say it again. So, anyways, um, here is a link to join Hang <clears throat> here when I click the off. So, uh, take care, everybody, and have a great rest of the evening, night, morning, day, whatever it is for you. So, have a great tomorrow as well. I love y'all, and see ya. Bye bye.